So I know we're all very excited for the Pooniverse. Um, but apparently we got our first look at the poster for Bambi the Reckoning. We also have an explanation of the plot. Uh, if you didn't know, Bambi the Reckoning is one of the movies that's coming out in the Pooniverse. There's our there's our good look at Bambi there. He looks he looks like a cuddly little creature, doesn't he? Uh, but apparently he's welcoming you to the stomping grounds. So let's go ahead and take a look at all this. So basically, Bambi the Reckoning is being described as Cujo meets Jurassic Park. Uh, in the film, after a mother and son get in a car wreck, they soon get haunted, hunted by Bambi, a mutated, grief-stricken deer on a deadly rampage for seeking revenge for the death of his mother. That that deer has a lot of issues to go through, but um, calling it Jurassic Park meets Cujo is really, I think... I don't want to say that's too much, but I feel like that's too much because it's not, in my opinion, going to be that great of a movie. Because they released the second Winnie the Pooh in theaters and everyone was like, this is this is terrible. Maybe they learned, maybe they didn't, but either way, let's keep going. Here's our first look at the poster. Uh, Bambi the Reckoning, Welcome to the Stomping Grounds. Uh, Bambi looks absolutely zombified and he's just ready to fuck shit up. Um... Director Dan Allen, he um, he directed Unhinged, which I'll explain to you in a minute. Uh, basically, the film is about the death of childhoods as much as it's going to ruin childhoods. Expect bloodshed, tear. I don't know if that's tears or tears, and rabbits, and one mean killer deer. At last, the British countryside will finally get its Godzilla. Uh, it stars Roxanne McKee from Rog Turn 5 and Game of Thrones. Uh... Uh, Tom Mullerhan as her son, uh, Nicola Wright from Sexy Beast, Samira Mai from Beauty and the Beast, Alex Cook from Blood Vessel, and Russell Jeffrey Banks from Ghost House. And if you don't know what Unhinged is, this is Unhinged. Love this movie. It kind of faded midway, but love this movie. If it's going to be like this, I think the movie will be good. What do you guys think?